number two, uh, our group is still fake IDs. Um, we are gonna focus on fake IDs and underage drinking and demographic of social impact, risks, and age. So our research, our research question is, at what age do Lynn's students use fake IDs and how does this influence underage drinking? This is how we're best gonna understand our patterns of social and risk. Our survey is qualitative survey, over 300 answers. There, there's going to be 40 questions that each group is going to have. It's going to grade five questions. They're going to be random, a randomly around campus. Like we are going to give our iPads to a student and they're going to answer the question. And this is better as opposed to email or posting a link on Facebook to our survey because we're trying to keep it confidential. So first of all, if we do a Facebook link, we're not going to know. We're not going to be guaranteed um, 10 exact responses. And, and they, we don't know if they're going to do it. Yeah, so we're going to try to keep it as confidential as possible and just hand someone the iPad, which is completely casual around the campus. So for our survey, we composed five questions that best reflect our patterns. Question number one is, do you find yourself using a fake ID so you're not missing out with friends? Yes or no? Have you ever been in trouble with the cops for using a fake ID? Yes or no? Have you ever worried about getting caught with your ID? That reflects the risk pattern. Do you ever, do your friends ever influence you to get a fake ID? And freshman year of college, would you say that you use your fake ID every weekend? Um, we pinpointed freshman year to get a better, assuming that obviously everyone we're asking is in college, so. Everyone starts out their freshman year, so they have to know if they use a fake ID every weekend. So as far as recruitment, we're targeting 19 to 20 year olds on campus at here at Lynn. This better gives us because 21 year olds don't use a fake ID. Um, we are asking people friend in a friendly manner if they can just take our survey. You know, we have a bunch of friends on campus, so people aren't going to say no. And we are. Um, excluding all non lin students and students under 18 or 21 and over. So the risks and discomforts um, for taking the survey, it, there's psychological risks that might bring up bad memories and topics they might not want to discuss. Um, and social risks, if your friends find out, they might think of you differently. But to mitigate this risk, we are going to keep everything confidential and the participants, if they feel uncomfortable, they can stop the survey at any time. So moving on to our oral consent form. Uh, inform, inform before taking the survey. Uh, un understand inf influential social and risk in impacts. It will be 15 minutes of honesty. Uh, but voluntary participation may grade at any time. Confidential, com, confi, <laughs> confidentiality and contact information. So our information will be provided at the end of the survey if anyone has any follow-up questions or an issue. And that is our presentation.